It's James Bond backstage at the O2. Jesse J. Jesse J, everyone. Yay! Did you see all the things going on for the end? It just went down. It was amazing at the end, and they all went bang. It all went bang. It all went bang at the end. It was filled with ticker tape. Oh, oh, it was amazing. I got it stuck to my foot. It was like coloured toilet roll. I nearly got stuck to you then when I was giving you a hug because you got so <laughs> many sequins and things. I got stuck to your trousers. Look at you, look We're at like you. silver and gold. Where's Mer? <laughs> uh, Murs was here yesterday. Ollie Murs, Murs played the ball last night. <laughs> Tonight, all about you. It was a major performance. Jesse, how did that feel? Because uh, I don't know yet. I think it will sink in next week. I don't think I realised how big it was until the sound check was so quick. And, you know, you're not in the outfit and the people aren't in their seats. And so when you go out and it's like, whoa. And, I, yeah, I was just, yeah, I, that, was, that was definitely a massive Christmas present that I just received from the world. And your heartbeats, they love you on Twitter. Twitter yeah, is just mental oh, right now for they, you. They mean so much and, um, you know, they've, they, they support me all the time, you know, whatever I'm going through. And, and tonight was just uh, definitely something that I needed this week. And, um, yeah, it feels really good. I'm excited. I'm happy. I'm excited to celebrate and actually feel... I feel Christmassy now. I need to eat a tangerine and I'll be sorted. There was this story this week that you nearly quit music and then obviously this year has been so sensational. It must can, I just, can I just say that, that that story was from a year ago and the media are trying to make it out that it's come out now. It didn't. I spoke about that when I wrote Who You Are three and a half years ago and that's when I felt like I wasn't ready to be in the music industry and I wasn't strong enough. So just to make that clear, I'm not quitting music. And um, No but, way. We're not no, letting you quit music. No, I, I just, you know, and... It, yeah, it was a scary time, and I'm always going to be honest about it. And there may be times that come in the future where I'm like, I don't think I can do this anymore. But you have to just make sure that you surround yourself with people that you trust and love you and want you to be you. And and I, you know, and I have that in my fans. So yeah, and my family and my friends. So I mean, I'm, I'm, you know, it's yeah. Sorry, I'm on a buzz right now. I just, I've literally just seen half of like Toys R Us go up on stage. <laughs> Where did you get the cracker outfit from? I don't know. We ordered it offline. We've got about 18 uh, different choices. A Christmas pudding, a s snowman. Um, what else was there? The Santa's Little Helper, Christmas tree. But the cracker just felt... I don't know, it just felt quite quite funny. I think I, I think you made the cracker sexy. I don't know if you could have ah! made the, the Christmas well, pudding it, sexy. Well, it was just the fact that my head was like coming from the top and I was just like, this is the most ridiculous thing I've ever done. And I tried to get Wretch to wear a Santa costume and he, and he didn't do it. He put the hat on at the he end. Did, he did, and he was amazing and his bars were amazing and I only asked him to do that about four hours ago and he put that together very quickly and so thank you, Wretch. And um, yeah, that was that was a very, very special moment. You text Wretch through to the lyrics, right? No. Oh, did he, he said he, that you text them and then he was reading them and trying to learn them and... No, no, he wrote that. Oh, he wrote and his own bit, yeah. He just wrote that literally in the last three hours and I saw him just before my, just after my soundtrack and he was like, listen to this and he did it and I was like, dude, that's sick. Um, and it's just nice to have an exclusive and him to come on stage tonight, you know? Absolutely. Massive fan of his. We're going to hear you live now. This is you performing is Who's it? Laughing Now. All right. So, Jesse, introduce it. Okay. And this is Jesse J, who last year couldn't get on the guest list for, for Jingle Bell Ball. Uh, and hold this up. this year, this year, <laughs> I headlined. It was amazing. And uh, this is me singing Who's Laughing Now. So, who's laughing now? Yeah. <laughs>